Yep, yeah, invest in precious metal, folks. We are here at the official launch and delivery of the new Porsche 993 GT3. And uh, just give you a taste of uh, the things to come. Believe it or not, this is a wrap. Yep. A beautiful, beautiful wrap which was uh, done by none other than my buddy Remus Chang of Motorsport Playground. What an amazing rap. Nice one, Remus. So, okay, we're going to head to the front straight now. You're not going to be able to hear me much because it's going to be really, really loud. But stay tuned as we head for the front straight for the launch of the 911 GT3. Porsche has invited media as well as customers and potential customers for this launch. Auto Performance, Christoph Hunter, handover ceremony of the uh, new owners of the 911 GT3 RS so they collect the cars today and they go for some hot laps I mean how brilliant is that and it's actually starting to rain Certified Porsche driving instructors just uh, assisting the new customers of the 911 GT3 RS on how to get comfortable, to get the perfect driving position, to fully appreciate just how spectacular this okay. car is. Sure. Good. I am um, all that again.
Hey, how's it going, buddy? Yeah, Good to see you. Yeah. Okay, this is a GT2 RS. Yeah. The full roll cage and everything. And there's another. Morning. Hey, I get a Porsche raincoat. I wonder if I can walk faster. So the uh, customers are about to take to the track. Unfortunately, it started raining. And uh, let's hope they keep the uh, traction control on. Keep it low. The cars have been six or seven thousand RPM. Okay. In a dry configuration. They have not been tested with a high thermal force on a track. So please take it easy. You're going to have guided driving with Will, and he is going to instruct you on how best to take the track. Okay, so please, no overtaking, no diving into corners, be mindful. So we wait now for the uh, owners of the new Porsche 911 GT3 RS to take to the track. And the first time they are actually driving their cars on Sepang. A few of them are actually just collected the cars today. In fact, uh, one of the GT2 RS's just now, which I showed on this video, this is the first time the owner is actually sitting in the car. He's actually collecting his car today. And his first time driving his car is gonna be on the Sepang International Circuit now. I don't know about other car deliveries, but to me, that's the coolest. And here they go. It's actually starting to rain pretty hard now, so that's why they all keep the traction control on. they do their first laps I'm gonna pause and I'm gonna show you something really really special so something very 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 special <laughs> words cannot even begin to describe what I felt when I saw this car go by just now it is just unbelievable 
to me it's absolutely priceless absolutely priceless fantastic how special is that also done by motorsport playground my buddy Remus standing over there sir Remus beautiful absolutely beautiful so under the uh, spotlights of uh, Sepang International Circuit paddock number 22 here's what a GT3 RS looks like in normal day-to-day -day configuration Hey, that's me. PCCB, Porsche Ceramic Composite Brakes. Or is it Composite Ceramic? Ceramic Composite, something like that. But anyway, they cost more than my whole car. And it's quite depressing when just the brake discs alone are bigger than your rim. Any chance to save weight? Even those. Damn, it's locked. 